guys, it's Queen Bijan, and today's video, I will be reacting to Green 2 episode 21 of No Guns Life, so let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Honestly, I thought that was going to kill him. I mean, this child is too OP now. I'm like, what else did you <laughs> killing him and you know what I'm honestly really okay with that because I don't really like the creator of the extent he's like, oh god he's like someone that you really just despise that you literally mm -hmm. don't really give a crap for whatever happens to him honestly that's awesome mm -hmm. Don't pull that out. <laughs> well, I mean, because you're an end, so.
<laughs> the fact that he still talks about him, oh my god. <laughs> And even if you kill him, it's not gonna bring those people back. I mean, yeah, you can do it for them, for yourself. I heck, if I was you, I would. But still, it's not gonna bring them back. You may have peace for a while, but there will always be someone else there. Get out safely, please, Toto. Um, what was that? We just hold on. We're not even going to talk about what just happened. What? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, you can't do that. <laughs> oh, my God. You can't just fling something out on me and then, like, mm, let's just go to the next scene over to Jiso. Forget what you just saw. Excuse me. Let me guess the other one is. Yep.
I think we all thought that that was a guy, <laughs> but, um... So then who is your sponsor? Tetsuro? This is why we don't trust. Oh my god. I I mean, but the fact that he like like woo. I think he's about to kill her. Well, I mean, you know, At least it was her hand and, you know, not her whole body. So then that has to be Pepper. That, oh my god. Not really, I've seen worse. Yeah, but you want to improve, right? He's fine.
somebody's jealous. I mean, but seven. But you need someone to hold that. You can't do that by yourself. Smile. <laughs> so it's here. Oh. Crystal did the same thing. Oh my god. Where the heck have you been? Oh my god. They wait until episode 21 to bring him back. Oh my god. Y'all gotta be kidding me. Yeah, even if you can't, he's gonna try. Of course, he would be running away.
Bruh, what is going on? Come on, man, about to kick his ass. He might even kill me, too. <laughs> oh, my God. But, uh, I just need Tessa to wake up. I mean, yes, he's kind of lost. He's lost, like, mm, I don't know. How much blood has he possibly lost? Possibly a lot, but... Okay, so this fight between Seven and Juzo, like, oh, this is good, but Pepper with that slice, oh my god, girl, like, ooh, I, like, literally, I was expecting her to just go all the way down and literally just one-shot this woman and be like, well, you know, hey, there you are, in two pieces on the floor, but, uh, ugh. What the hell do I show you about this? I mean, this was a really good episode. I, I didn't expect Cronin to make another appearance in this episode because we hadn't seen him since the first half of this show. And I assumed that he was never coming back. But they were like, nope, here you go. He's back. So, okay, now my thing is Olivier has been put in the back burner. Put my best girl back up in front in these last three episodes because I'm just saying there's three episodes left and how in the world are you just going to give everyone their time to shine? I mean, but mm, who knows? Like one, since we now have three episodes left, I don't think they're going to end this show with Juzo being dead. I think he's still going to... He's gonna get out of this alive, no matter what. We all know that, because Juzo's the main character, and I don't think they would kill him off just to have Mary and um, Tetsuro to continue the show, because that... I mean, not the show, the series, because that's like, if you have a show or a movie, anime series, whatever, and here's two or three main characters, and you're supporting all three characters... And then they decide to go ahead and kill one of them and try to continue on with the other two. I've mainly seen this with some of my TV shows, and I've never seen them do this in an anime before. Um, 50 out of 50, you know, when they're trying to continue that show with the other two people, but you're, you wanted to watch that show for all three of these actors or actresses, whoever, and you sit here and you look like, well, you know, it's kind of not really a show anymore because... It was for the three of y'all, and now it's the two of y'all, and then it could be the one of y'all, and why do I need to spend my time watching this show anymore? But I don't think they're going to kill him. I think this this fight between Seven and Pepper, um, Seven and Pepper, Seven and Juzo will possibly end with both of them getting badly injured. I feel like this episode, this fight is going to go until about episode 20... 20, maybe halfway to 23, maybe? I don't know, but we're going to be going back and forth between Seven and Juzo and what the guy with Cronin and seeing how their fight goes. Because I do feel like Tessido is going to wake up and he's going to be like, what the frick just happened? Like, the last thing I know is, like, I heard something get pulled off. <laughs> I mean, the creator's head got pulled off and that was it. I mean, oh... But I'm just, I'm praying to God that this show ends with, like, a happy ending. And that we're okay. And that everybody's fine. Even though it, it may not. We, I, we got, like, three more weeks left with this show. And I have no clue how in the world this is going to end. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 21 of No Guns Life. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day for the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Thursday for episode 21. Bye, guys.